Some people might think he's a dingling, but for Doug Bone, collecting antique phones is an obsession. His hobby began four years ago when Mr. Bone retired. His interest in antiques soon mushroomed into a full-time occupation. Today, his home is lined with 160 phones. The collection is composed largely of Canadian and American models with a few rare European varieties to round out his display. His earliest phone dates back to 1878. Here he displays the first commercial telephone ever to be used in the country. This contraption had the mouthpiece and receiver united in one piece of equipment. Mr. Bone believes he has almost every telephone ever manufactured in Canada and even some American relics from the wild, wild west. His Dawson City Gold Rush phone is a treasure hunter's delight. As well, he has a 1907 switchboard which is still operational. And a telegraph system that dates back long before the telephone was even invented. On that issue, Mr. Bone clarified a popular misconception. The telephone was not invented in Canada. The idea was conceived while Alexander Graham Bell was living in Brantford, but those famous first few words were sent from the first working model ever built, and that was in Boston. Though his collection will probably never be complete, Mr. Bone will continue to seek out decrepit phones to refinish and polish in his basement workshop. As a member of the Telephony Society of Canada and the Antique Telephone Collectors Association of America, he has direct access to a steady flow of phones. And when the phone does ring at Doug Bones, he's got 160 to choose from. Heather Horn, CKVR News, Lefroy.